I come from Schaeffer's electroacoustics ideas of the 60s, 50s, and late 40s. So it's very old. He had an idea that we can hear sounds in a different way and uh, take us away from the notes and the instrumental music as they knew it in these times. <coughs> so he had an idea or he heard something that made him perceive in the sound different things characteristic. For, for you now, this is very obvious. But in the 60s, it was not at all obvious. <coughs> and uh, he made, uh, in this moment, a uh, solfer, because the solfer was the thing that everybody talked in instrumental music. A solfer, and um, I hate this name, um, he Thing. He thought that it was possible to do a lot of hearing in a very different way. So, instead of hearing um, a car, you can hear a complex sound. Instead of hearing a note, you can hear a tonic sound. And a tonic sound, you can hear it in every, in the world, you can hear this sound as a tonic sound. It has a, 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 it's, it's like a note, but it can be a note, but it's uh, a sound that has not, it's not very, it has a pitch. I'm very, it's very difficult for me to talk all this in English. So, what I'm going to do now, because Caroline asked me to do this for you, <laughs> I think it's a little bit different. I mean, I do an atelier with this uh, one one day atelier, so the people um, learn to do all this characteristic for the voice, and it's a way for the composers or the youngest to really think and hear the sound inside of them before doing them and search them and do them. So the way of uh, hearing inside of them a sound or a music or a composition, or I don't know what, begins for me in a way of being aware of all the characteristics of the sounds. For example, a tonic sound, it's a It has a pitch. It kind of has a form, can has a variation, can be with no no uh, no form, continue, and then goes go goes. You have complex sounds; they have no pitch, but can can be in the high pitch, low pitch, medium pitch. They don't have a pitch, but they have a material, a kind of quality that is complex. And it has, it can has a form. It can has a movement, a variation. Or it has, it can be little things like impulsions staccato, for example, the piano staccato on a trumpet and so on. But Schaeffer had the intelligence to give other names to all these qualities of the sound or the way of doing the sound, change the names of it. The staccato began to be an iterative. A horse, when it goes, how do you say, galopa. Uh, it's an iterative, where you run, it's an iterative. Um, a, a lot of gun shouting, it's an iterative. It's an iterative. It's a lot of impulsions. And every, every sound in the world 
can be done like that. You can hear it in every part of the world. So you have the iterative, tonic iterative, for example, variation of this. You can have <laughs> impulsions like this. Complex variation, tonics. You can have, and we can find in, in everywhere, other kind of uh, characteristics of the sound. Trama, the web, is something that goes on complex it goes and goes and goes if it doesn't move it is not and variated it's complex tonic and the tonic too it's all the sound that goes there are two people there that can do all these sounds but I don't know if they are going to come and do it with me no 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 for the moment so you have we have all this kind of characteristic that gives you the possibility of hearing the sound that you don't hear here because of this. When everybody is clapping, you have a very complex sound. And in the Jerem, in the 60s, as not nobody knows how to compose with this because there was no teacher. Jefer was not a teacher. He didn't know how to compose. He did his, his uh, performs his uh, music in, in, a, in a way, but uh, we didn't know how to do it. Parmigiani, he was a, a sort of genius, and he did his music, and Francois Bell his music, and Evo Malek his music, and Ferrari went everywhere with, 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 a, with the microphone to have his sounds, and I did mine. So we didn't copy nobody because we have n nobody to copy. And when I do this uh, kind of atelier, because uh, for the people it's very, very difficult to do all these sounds with the voice, because it's very personal. Um, it takes hours and hours to make them move, to make them feel the sound, to make them do a sound, to make them imagine the sound. And only one sound, it's easier to do. What is very, very difficult to do is when it begins to change the characteristic. For example, if you have a complex sounds and you want to change it in a, in, in a iterative sound. For example, the characteristic change. All these exercises I do them. I do them because uh, I told them if you want to compose, if you want to do a sound, and you want to do a music, a very soft music with electronics and all this, you don't need to have all this. You don't need to hear this. You don't need to even think about it. But if you want to do composition, what the name composition means, it com. Posing, posing with. What are you going to put with? How and why? And then in the composition, in the electroacoustic music or every composition, there are a lot of things like in the music, in the sound. The sound is given by time and energy. The sound is energy in the time time with energy. And when we do music and we hear music, you feel the breathing. You have three things that are going on there. So when somebody must do this 
kind of exercise. He must be very aware about breathing, because he has only the breathing, breathing, the timing of the sound, and how it will be done. And electroacoustic composition, it's, um, this is absolutely the ABC of, of this kind of composition. When you don't do it, you can put all the sounds you want. You will have a lot, lot of bordel, I don't know in English, a mess about sounds coming from everywhere. You don't know what's coming on. But um, why not? No? It's, a, it's a question of uh, feeling. It's a question of uh, choosing what you want to do. So you see, uh, I can talk 10 minutes or half an hour, but all the things I have done, I have seen now, I can talk to you. Um, I asked one of the person that had an atelier, because I cannot do this, it's a mixage. And mixing, it's putting two sounds together. It's not only one sound that change and do things. It's mixing. And in composition, they are mixing things. Notes, they have the, when the, peop the, the, the girl that taught before, he has the score with all this. It, this is an in between the composer and the orchestra or the people that will do this music. We don't have this, we have a loudspeakers. But um, when people say that the score, it's what we see in the computer, I say no, because when you look at this, you cannot hear what is going on. Because it's only a schema, schema, schema. And the score with instrument, we know because it's in between, you know that it has a note, an instrument, it will sound more or less like that. But in, in a computer, in a, I don't know if you have the problem, but in Pro Tools you can see this, a lot of score. It's not a score, uh, you don't know what's, what's going on. So, for the composition, for the young composer, uh, my uh, the atelier that I did, it was only a way of make them be uh, aware of the music they have. And they see that each person is different. So each music is different. They don't need to copy the friends. They can choose <laughs> their sounds in electronics or in other and uh, refer open this kind of hearing to all the sounds in the world, the electronics, the voices, the instrumental, and the noises. So we have all what we want there for us. But I cannot give you a mixing. So I ask <laughs> if you want to come and do a mixing with me. <laughs> Two sounds together, it's a mixing. It's not only a sound that changes. You have this. Ça marche? No? Oui? Okay. Oui, oui. So you can begin with a sound if you want. Okay. Um. Bah. Well, this is very short. She didn't give a lot of breathing. A lot of <laughs> breathing. So it's a very short. When you have this in your in your computer, you say, "Well, right, I don't know what I'm going to do you with this." You want it longer. Uh, you yes. must do a <laughs> very beautiful sound with one breathing. Okay. So you take a big breathing and you go. <laughs> well, if you want to, well, can you do it twice? Mm -hmm. <laughs> There were two sounds together. Can I give you a sound and you take another one to yes. the mixing? Will not be the same. 
guy. No. Mixing two sounds, a little bit more than mixing two sounds. Well, I don't know what to say more because um, this is our electroacoustic music. It's, we try to put sounds that are very strange together and have. We try to do music with it. For some people, this is music, for other people, us sounds for other people are nothing, only nothing. So that's all. I cannot say nothing else. <laughs>